Hey everyone, Couch here, hope you're okay. So, I've got hold of a new laptop, an Acer Nitro, uh, which has Thunderbolt 3 connection with four PCIe lanes. My typical laptop is a Dell XPS 9550 with two PCIe lanes for its Thunderbolt 3 connection. And so what I wanna do is some tests using an external eGPU uh, to see how that affects performance. Uh, I've been led to believe that having four PCIe lanes uh, increases performance uh, quite a bit. Uh, and so I'm gonna do tests out to an external monitor and back to the laptop screens. This test here is to an external monitor at 1080p uh, using the superposition uh, benchmarking by Unigen. Uh, it's on high settings. And I can tell you now, uh, in conclusion for all of the stuff going out to an external monitor that it doesn't make a difference. Uh, in fact, the Dell XPS performs better than the Acer Nitro uh, at 1080p and at 1440p going out to an external monitor. At 4K, the Acer uh, just, just beats the Dell, um, but in either case, the, the results are so minute, uh, the difference that you wouldn't really care. So if you're going to be gaming to an external monitor and you have a laptop with two PCI lanes and you're thinking, oh, it's not gonna be uh, good enough with an external eGPU, um, well, I'm, you know, I'm gonna say that's bollocks, it'll be fine. Uh, perhaps uh, with other peripherals attached to your eGPU, like a, a solid state drive, that's when you'll find a bottleneck. I'll do some videos testing that. I'll also do some videos uh, testing um, running back to the laptop uh, screen instead of using an external monitor. That's where we'd expect to see a performance gain. Uh, how big, we'll find out in another video. That's it. Um, as always, uh, please like, please comment. Uh, let me know if you want me to test anything specific. I'll do some games after I've done the benchmarking in different uh, scenarios. Um, apart from that, enjoy the video. Sorry for talking for too long. Take care. Bye.